interesting. They're very nutritious. And they have a lot of, uh, in the trunk, the main trunk goes up, creates one bunch of bananas, and then dies. If you cut it up, it's wonderful mulch. All new banana trees come from pups, those little things sprouting up. And what they've done over here in, in part of their process, they're now, uh, one guy said, well, why can't we split it? It's two. Now they're getting over 600 out of a pup. So when they get an order to send banana trees, you can do a lot of good all around the world with one banana tree. See? Now this is the prickly pear, beaver tail, whatever you want to call it. There's two kinds. One is one has prickly needles that get you pretty quick. This one doesn't. This is pretty smooth. So we try to use this one when we're doing things. You can eat any part of it. There's always water everywhere. And if you just peel it back a little bit, you can eat the meat. And sometimes we have uh, samples over there when we get back. And if there is some, you want to try it, because it is good. Otherwise, there's bulbs. Uh, can anybody spout a bulb? Well, this would be kind of an end of a bulb. But um, <coughs> I, I ate one this morning when I went around. I don't know if it really. Well, it's kind of bitter. I don't know if anybody wants to even try it. It's kind of different. You want to try it? Do you want to try it? Do you want to? Oh, uh -huh. thanks. And the, the little red. Oh, up there. I don't think I'm getting any taller. Oh, now, you want a, want a little bit? Feel, this this is fresh. You just take a little bit, you know. Eat what you want. We uh, we can't tell everybody to eat everything because we don't, we don't know your health problems or anything else. Did you want some? 